Fortinet NSC4 4070.0 NSC4 underscore FGT minus 7.0 real exam questions are the best material for you to pass the test. Share some Fortinet certification NSC4 underscore FGT minus 7.0 exam questions and answers here. 1. An administrator does not want to report the logon events of service accounts to Fortigate. What setting on the collector agent is required to achieve this? A. Add user accounts to the ignore user list. B. Add the support of NTLM authentication. C. Add user accounts to the Fortigate group filter. D. Add user accounts to Active Directory, AD. 2. Which two statements are true about the security fabric rating? Choose 2. A. The security fabric rating is a free service that comes bundled with all FortiGate devices. B. Many of the security issues can be fixed immediately by clicking Apply where available. C. The security fabric rating must be run on the root FortiGate device in the security fabric. D. It provides executive summaries of the four largest areas of security focus. 3. An administrator has configured outgoing interface any in a firewall policy. Which statement is true about the policy list view? A. Interface pair view will be disabled. B. Search option will be disabled. C. Policy lookup will be disabled. D. By sequence view will be disabled. 4. Which two statements about SSL VPN between two FortiGate devices are true? Choose 2. A. The client FortiGate requires a client certificate signed by the CA on the server FortiGate. B. The client FortiGate requires a manually added route to remote subnets. C. The client FortiGate uses the SSL VPN tunnel interface type to connect SSL VPN. D. Server FortiGate requires a CA certificate to verify the client FortiGate certificate. 5. Which two statements are correct about SLA targets? Choose 2. A. You can configure only two SLA targets per one performance SLA. B. SLA targets are optional. C. SLA targets are required for SD1 rules with a best quality strategy. D. SLA targets are used only when referenced by an SD1 rule. 6. Which statement is correct regarding the inspection of some of the services available by web applications embedded in third party websites? A. The security actions applied on the web applications will also be explicitly applied on the third party websites. B. The application signature database inspects traffic only from the original web application server. C. FortiGuard maintains only one signature of each web application that is unique. D. FortiGate can inspect sub-application traffic regardless where it was originated. 7. Which engine handles application control traffic on the next generation firewall? NGFW, FortiGate. A. Intrusion Prevention System Engine. B. Detection Engine. C. Flow Engine. D. Antivirus Engine. 8. Why does FortiGate keep TCP sessions in the session table for several seconds? Even after both sides, client and server, have terminated the session? A. To allow for out-of-order packets that could arrive after the FIN, ACK packets. B. To finish any inspection operations. 
c to generate logs d to remove the NAT operation. 9. Which CLI command allows administrators to troubleshoot Layer 2 issues, such as an IP address conflict? A. Get system performance status B. Get system status C. Get system R D. Diagnose SYS top 10. A network administrator is configuring a new IPSUC VPN tunnel on FortiGate. The remote peer IP address is dynamic. In addition, the remote peer does not support a dynamic DNS update service. What type of remote gateway should the administrator configure on FortiGate for the new IPSUC VPN tunnel to work? A. Dial-up user B. Static IP address C. Pre-shared key D. Dynamic DNS